Welcome, folks, to Let's Play Legendary X. Uh, Legendary X is a hue card game for the Tobo Graphics. It's a side scroller, slash em up, basically. And. Not sure of the plot lines. Apparently, some evil force took over. Took your girlfriend, so you have to go save her. That's pretty much the whole plot. So, you can jump, slash, then you got your health right here, this is your power up bar, which you get from getting, uh, spider orbs. <laughs> I don't know what they really are, but you, you get one of them from a spider, which I'll show soon. Anyways, you got all sorts of enemies from bats to kind of oldish looking people with the axes. Then you got spiders, like so. To deal with this person is pretty simple, which you've already seen. Slash, let him get near down to the floor. Then you just slash at him. Come on. I'm not very good at this game, so we'll see how far I get. <laughs> I've never actually beaten this game, so at a certain point, I will not know what to do. So you may actually see myself like any other time, blunder around like a moron. And there we go, a power up. This helps, you know, damage and all that, so it just works like that. And it gets bigger as you go throughout the game. You don't get all of them from boss fights, I think some of them are just items. So it's not necessarily a conditional, conditional gain, you can miss some power-ups. I'm sure you can beat this whole game without a power-up, but I would not recommend it. I'm really horrible about this game. Really bad. Okay. Bastards. And of course, there's a lot of platforms to jump on. And I don't think it's the worst platformer I've played as far as jumping mechanics, but it can be very difficult, especially when you got enemies jumping around at you. And enemies do become more, I don't want to say harder, but more annoying. <laughs> and then here comes a boss fight. Bears! Finding the uh, Yogi Bear and uh, what's his little, little friend. Okay. I don't got any picnic baskets, leave me alone. That wasn't too hard. Yay, you clear first zone. Let's try second zone. Flare is waiting for you. And I love the music in this game too. And I'll probably upload the soundtrack as well. But this is going to take a little bit more, um, it's going to be a little bit more difficult because I have to record this, the music since I do not have the, uh, I can't, I can't seem to rip the song, for, I can't find it on Google or anything like that for the rip soundtrack, so, and I'm not technically inclined to do it, so, I'll go my own means on that, so, anyways, that was a lizard person, 
They're very annoying. And so are these bats. And a butterfly. Stupid butterflies. Okay. Usually there's a um, ah, damn it. Power up uh shit. Usually there's God fucking uh, die. Okay, back to what I was saying. Usually there's a uh, power up um containers hidden behind these, so you always want to check just so you don't you know miss something. See, it's kind of hard to see, but that one's pretty easy. Oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Can't even get a break to think. Okay. Son of a bitch. Oh, I'm almost dead. Oh no. God. This is why I hate these enemies because they seem to always have the range to jump at you. The only way you can really get them is if you get them in a juggle. I'm not even sure if this is a good idea right now. I'm really low on health. And the next enemy that's coming up is very, very frustrating. Like, see? Very frustrating. A giant boulder. And this the screams out boss. So So I die. Anyways. Let's let's try that again. And I will use the save states on this game. Okay, let's see if I can remember how to fight this. Not like that. Let's see how far back that sent me. That's why I like to use save states. Two hits, your game over. Okay, let's start that again. Do that over. Hit one of these, get that. Shit! Jump. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Alright. Now, save state. Okay. Boulder, boulder, boulder. Stop. Okay, what do you want to do is try to jump close to it without it. And jump close to it, hit it, then get the hell out of the way when you can. But of course, it's second like this game, so. <laughs> oh no. Let's try that again. This is why, I'll be honest with you, I've only beat this boss a few times. I've never gotten past the second level too often anyways. You wouldn't think a, a giant boulder be a very difficult boss, but he is. Oh no, oh no, ah! <sighs> I'm gonna do that off screen, one second. Alright folks, I got the boulder to be 
not glowing green this time. So, let's see if I can finish this boss off while recording and not show myself to be a, a moron about this. Okay, come here, come here. Oh crap. It's almost dead, it's almost dead. Hell yeah. Cleared second zone. Let's try third zone. Player is waiting for you. Okay. Let's do a quick save. Alright. Oh, crap! Bastard died. Those birds, I think they'll, yeah, do that. They're kind of hard to hit. I've never made, I don't think I ever, um, I died. Uh, <laughs> can't be stupider than that. <laughs> yeah, let's try that again. <laughs> what I was going to say is I get lost in this in this level, because it's a little bit less linear than the other two, and because of that, it's, it makes jumping a little bit more difficult, because you don't know, because, at least for me anyways, you'll find yourself in an awkward situation trying to jump from one platform to the other. But then again, it's me, I don't, I don't do uh, platforms well. Hey Rock Dude, he's difficult. Alright, I'm gonna call that a video, so, till next time, folks, Nafisa's going out.